Road to GH will reveal that after learning Jason risked his life to save Sasha from Sidwell's brutal captivity, Anna feels a wave of anger mixed with disappointment rise within her. Previously, she had always considered Jason a trustworthy ally, someone willing to fight by her side in any situation. However, upon discovering that Jason concealed Holly's theft of the Golden Needle, a critical event that jeopardized everyone under Sidwell's revenge, Anna couldn't help but feel betrayed. The more she thought about it, the more Anna realized that Jason's loyalty didn't truly belong to anyone but Sonny. He seemed to always prioritize Sonny's interests, regardless of the harm it might bring to others. This not only hurt Anna but also made her question whether her trust in Jason was a mistake. She understood that if Jason wasn't truly aligned with her, all the group's plans and efforts could be threatened at any moment. Thus, Anna decided to assign the investigation of Sidwell to Dex a person she trusted and knew would remain loyal to the group's goals. Dex didn't hesitate, immediately diving into the investigation, hoping to find evidence to use against Sidwell and bring to light his illegal actions, however, this mission turned out to be more dangerous than they anticipated. While gathering information, Dex was ambushed and attacked by Sidwell's men. The attack was fierce, and Dex was critically injured. To the point of being in a life-threatening condition. Shocked upon receiving the news, Anna immediately rushed Dex to the hospital. Dex's condition was grave, and the doctors had to put in their utmost effort to save him. While waiting outside the operating room, Anna felt tormented and remorseful, blaming herself for putting Dex in danger. She began to question whether her decision was right and worried that the fight against Sidwell could lead to more unwanted losses. Anna understood that she was not only facing a dangerous enemy but also confronting her own risky choices. During Dex's recovery at the hospital after his injury and unconsciousness, Jocelyn accidentally discovered a well-hidden USB in his jacket pocket. Initially, she thought it was just a personal item, but curiosity led her to open it to see the contents inside. What she found completely stunned and confused her, the USB was filled with information on Sonny's illegal transactions, Anna's covert actions, and even Sidwell's dark schemes, each document and piece of evidence appeared before Jocelyn like an unexpected story about the dark sides Dex had been collecting for a long time. The data was so detailed that she felt Dex wasn't merely observing but actively tracking each of their steps. Financial transactions, secret meetings, and shady plans, everything was meticulously and carefully recorded, Jocelyn began to question, why would Dex keep such sensitive and dangerous information? Was he plotting something? Was he the man she thought, a sincere and trustworthy person, or was he merely a two-faced individual with hidden motives she had never suspected? Dex possessing this USB made Jocelyn doubt his true character. Was he acting as a spy, gathering information to benefit someone? Or was he trying to protect himself by keeping the secrets of powerful and dangerous people? The more she thought, the more Jocelyn felt she could no longer trust Dex as fully as before. She realized that she might only know a small part of who he truly was and that, whether their feelings were genuine or not, Dex had a significant secret he didn't want anyone to know. This discovery put Jocelyn in a dilemma, should she remain silent and stay by his side, or should she confront him and demand an explanation when he woke up? Perhaps Jocelyn should choose to pretend she knows nothing about the USB and the dark information she had just uncovered. By keeping this secret to herself, she could silently observe Dex and learn more about his true intentions without arousing his suspicion. Jocelyn understood that if anyone in Port Charles, especially powerful individuals like Sonny, Anna, Jason, or even Sidwell, discovered she knew about their covert dealings and schemes, she could be in danger. By feigning ignorance, Jocelyn would be safer, avoiding becoming a target for those willing to protect their secrets at all costs. She decided to watch Dex's every move closely noting even the smallest details of his behavior and words when they were together. Jocelyn would also listen to what Dex said when he woke up, hoping to pick up any sign revealing his connections to Sonny, Sidwell, or even his real purpose in keeping such sensitive information. Although it was challenging to continue their relationship without knowing the truth, Jocelyn realized that caution was her only option. She understood that any action could backfire making her a target for those willing to do anything to keep their secrets safe. And so, Jocelyn would continue to stay by Dex's side, hiding her suspicions, to gain the time to uncover who the man she loved truly was and how dangerous he might be.